One of the critical design parameters in air compressors is the compression ratio, which is the ratio of absolute discharge pressure to absolute suction pressure. The overall compression ratio is determined when the end user selects their desired discharge pressure. An 8 to 1 ratio is typical at 100 PSIG. The difference in a single versus two stage compressor is how much of that work is done across each stage. In a single stage unit, the full 8 to 1 compression ratio is required to compress air from atmospheric to 100 PSIG. A high compression ratio results in more force on the bearings that can lead to more frequent major repairs, which are expensive and require downtime. Additionally, operators will likely have a higher energy requirement for the same output. A two-stage compressor splits the compression cycle into two steps, which reduces the compression ratios. In this example, the compression ratio is reduced to 2.8 in each stage, which results in less heat of compression. With less heat, the compressor can also maintain tighter tolerances, resulting in increased efficiency and reliability. Two-stage compressor also have more bearings under less stress, which extends the overall life of the air compressor. This reduction also increases the efficiency of the compression cycle by reducing the amount of work done across each stage. So in summary, the benefits of the two-stage air compressor are up to 15% more flow in the same size air compressor, a decrease in overall power costs, and longer air in life with reduced downtime. You can reach out to your local Kaishan distributor for more information on which air compressor is best for your application. Visit us at kaishanusa.com.